Ah, I think it's on. <laughs> this is a, a review of. Uh, hello. This is a review of Levi Garrett, uh, which was sent to me by my very good friend Travis uh, from uh, the States. Um, this is my dog. Some of you may or may not have seen him. Nico, uh, he's an English Bull Terrier. Bred, as uh, General George Patton said, for combat. Um, though, you wouldn't think it would be. Bred for soakers and uh, chilling out. So I'm going to have a dip of for the Levi Garrett. I've tried. Uh, some of you who may or may not have followed my uh, my uh, kind of like my journey into chewing tobacco. I'm going to uh, yeah. Hmm. It's, uh, I've tried the Red Man, both the brands, I don't know whether there might be more, because uh, I've only tried two of them. I've tried the Red Man in the green and uh, white packet, and um, and I've tried the Red Man uh, Golden uh, Blend. And I have to say, the Levi Gat is kind of similar to that. Um, it's very nice. And... Um, I don't know where Nico might want to eat. I expect he would eat anything, you know. Um, uh, I, I quite like the, uh, the chore. It's um, it's a, a different experience uh, to the dip. Um, uh, oh, you know, well, I've been out for my usual uh, Thursday afternoon, and this is why I'm doing a video two days in a row, probably. Excuse me. Um, it's, uh, yeah, I've been out, I've had a few pints. This uh, brewery in Gosport, very nice. Uh, uh, sadly, my adult memory can't quite remember what the name of the brewery was but anyway it's in gospel which is just literally 10 15 minutes drive from there 20 minutes drive from there uh, there's a big naval base there the uh some of you uh, probably heard of the hms victory well it, that's uh we're not in gospel it's on the other side of the harbour but portsmouth and gospel and south sea they're all pretty much one and the same thing anyway my good friend travis uh sent me uh couple of tins of Copenhagen snuff, uh, a tin of uh, Copenhagen long cut and a bag of this silly white character. I kind of said I wanted to uh, wanted to try it. And um, it's uh, it's it's alright. I like the I like the tea. I'd like to try uh, I've heard uh, sort of oversold one the review of uh, I think it's called um, Day's Work, which is like a plug chewing tobacco which I'd like to try. And um, I've been, um, I've ordered some German chewing tobacco, which is here, but I'm going to do a review of that later, which is a plug as well, which is kind of like the uh, pipe tobacco plugs, uh, and you cut a bit off and you chew it. But um, it, it's all right, it's quite sweet. Um, the tobacco leaf is, I think, covered in molasses, and uh, yeah, it's all right. This is also a little bit of a uh, homage, I think, as um, our cousins across the uh, channel would say. <laughs> uh, a homage to uh, Clint Eastwood. I had the good fortune on a recommendation, again from Travis, to watch uh, Gran Torino at the weekend uh, with a couple of friends. Uh, I, I said to Travis, uh, it's funny thing, uh, a lot of these kind of films, so you grow up with them, don't you? Uh, I, to this day, remember, when I was nine years old when Elvis died, and I was in uh, Cornwall in my father's car listening to the radio when it was announced on the radio, and I, I have so I was really upset, and I remember that to this very day. And though dear old Clint's not passed away, he made his last film, which was uh, Gran Torino. 
and um, it's uh, it's a great film and well worth a watch. And uh, at my my homage is uh, that he does uh, come out of his uh, house with a bag of chore and have a a, a good pinch and a spit, uh, which is uh, which was great fun. I love uh, the film Josie Wells. So anyway, Levi Garrett. Uh, I'm told that beech nut's quite nice, so hopefully the next time I try some uh, chore, it will be uh, some of the old beech nut. So anyway, two videos in, in two days, quite quite uh, out of the ordinary for me, but uh, I like to do one after I've had a few pints with my dear friend Furt Wanger on a Thursday. So anyway, uh, you're going to say goodbye, Nico? This is what he does most of the time. <laughs> He's an old man now. Anyway, I hope you all have a good uh, evening. Cheers for now.